Hey YouTube, and Scale Addict here. I'm well overdue on an update on my 3D printing project, so I collected some of my models here and I'll show them to you. I've got a few finished models, some unfinished, and a bunch of other things sitting on my workbench that need my attention. So I've got a few new things to show. Uh, I'm going to take some individual clips and zoom in so you can see a little more detail. As always, I have all my information on my blog and I try to update that regularly with completed models. Um, and these, most of these items are available on Shapeways if you want to buy your own. Uh, thank you to those of you who have ordered my items and um, I'm looking forward to getting your feedback on uh, what you think. So uh, here goes. Okay, this is my all aluminum flatbed, a 53 foot version and a 48 foot version, spread axle, very modern looking with the arched deck. Um, right now, I'm pretty excited about the, uh, the prospects of multiple loads that I can put on this. So like most of my models, um, they just simply don't exist in N-Scale, so that's why I'm trying to fill the void. All right, this model is a Trail King bottom dump trailer, triple axle, and it's part of my answer to the void in N-Scale construction equipment. Here's a pair of 43 foot Wilson grain trailers. This is where it all started. The trailer on the Pete, my Antarctic version, was the very first model I did. I've got lots of photos on my blog of it. A more recent version is the simulated tarp, which is in front here. That model still needs some DOT striping and some details. Uh, and it is being pulled by a Showcase Miniatures Kenworth T600, which uh, did get a couple of those models from a friend just recently. So that's a nice addition to my collection. Here's a few truck models that I've finished so far. I've got a Peterbilt 379 and a Kenworth T800. The nice part about 3D printing is that now that I have a base model to work with, I can pretty much design whatever configuration that I need for future projects. All I have to do is make a tweak to a file, upload it to Shapeways, make an order, and in about 10 days I have the new item delivered to my door. I can clean it up and paint it. So knowing that I needed a lot of trucks for my next layout, which is more industrial based, it's nice to know that I have the ability to design whatever I need uh, and not worry about the significant void in N-Scale equipment that currently exists. So again, my shop is open on Shapeways. Uh, if you like the models that you see here, they're available. Drop me a line if you have any questions, I'd love to hear from you. And again, thanks for all your support.